behold the magnificent Digimon of the one and only Captain Illima. All right. Oh my God, six Pokemon. Jersey ah! family Illima. Please don't send out rival Kyo Thunder. It's shiny. <laughs> Yo, what's up guys? I'm Grandmaster Shaman and welcome back to the channel. Today we have episode 4 of our Pokemon Ultra Sun uh, randomized Nuzlocke. I'll just have you know I accidentally, I accidentally ended the stream instead of just end the recording. So that was kind of funny. So now I'm just starting the stream over again. But I mean that's okay. It, it just tells me how long I've been live again, which is redundant, I guess. But if you guys are enjoying this series, make sure you guys click that thumbs up button down below for me. Leave a comment in the comment section. And, of course, subscribe if you have not subscribed already. So in the last episode, we made it all the way through the trainer school. We caught our, our newest team member, as you can see, Marsh Top, chilling in the bottom part of the stream. As well as Marowak. And uh, make sure you guys check that out if you haven't already. We stole the heart of a beautiful maiden. Um, and that's why it seems we have been called up to the second floor office or at least that's what we think so without further ado we're gonna get right on into it hope you guys are having a great day i know i am having a, a quite the day myself Ahem, abby i can't believe that you beat all of my students that's fantastic after seeing such a performance i think i'd like to do you myself what do you say are you ready to take me on hi good i heard a about you from Professor Kukui. I'll be challenging you with a Digimon that has a type advantage against your pop Popthio that you chose as your starter. Will you? If you have a Grass or Electric type, you're probably right. Aether Foundation Emily sends out Mining. Well, she's right. She didn't lie. There's an Electric type. Oh my god, it's level 11. Holy shit. Lightning rods, my special attack, Rose Bitch. Let's go. Boom. That did so much damage. I don't think I have any special attacks. These are both physical attacks, aren't they? Encore. Maximum trainer AI at its finest. It gives me the special attack boost with the freaking lightning rod... Electric type attack. Alright, Lilo is up to level 12. Snevia grew up to level 13. Wants to learn Razor Leaf. I think that's probably a good move. We'll take out Tackle for the time being. We do have other options at that area, so that should be fine. Is about to send out Super Heavy Samurai. Alright. Do I have anything against fighting types? I don't. I mean, I'm probably just going to stay in, actually. What is this thing going to do to me? Do I, it shouldn't have knockoff yet. Because it goes by level up moveset. Oh, I can still only use Bone Club. That's fine. Alright, use Fake Out. It does not affect me. Would have been a smart move in any other situation. Alright, I still can't use my other moves yet. Use Fake Out, it doesn't hurt me. Alright, my Encore ended, so now I'm going to use Flame Wheel. Use Fake Out again. Yeah, so I, I don't think it has anything that can hit a Ghost Type. So Ghost Type... We're, we're, we're like really kind of OP at the beginning of the game. With a Ghost Type. This thing has so much freaking... Defense, but there's no way it can hit me unless, until it struggles to death. It's just faking out over and over again. Use fake out. We're slowly killing this thing. Can we get a crit? No? That's fine. Well, there goes Super Heavy Samurai in 338 juicy experience. 
has a lot of a lot of good experience. Wants to learn Leer. I think I'm good. Gerald's up to level 15. Kristoff is up to level 13. And we beat Aether, Fa Aether Foundation Emily. Nice. Maybe you'd like to take over as teacher here for me. All joking aside, though, I do want you to take these from me. It's a little more reward for beating me. You obtained five Great Balls of China. They're Great Balls. Great Balls are doing better at catching Digimon than regular Pokeballs. Crikey, you know you Digimon and know their moves. These are basics of being a duelist. How about it? Greetings, Captain Ilima here. I couldn't help but observe your duels. It looked like you were having a very delightful duel, and I had no choice but to summon you here. Crikey, this is Abby, who moved here from the Alo of, to Alola from the Kanto region. She's got a real sense of how to use moves, but I think she's going to be a go far as a duelist, eh? Oh, I see. Well, welcome, welcome, newcomer. I look forward to seeing the brilliance of the move at the trial. Indeed, yeah, we're captains and the ones who conduct the trials to face of the way to the tri island, island king. My trial in Verdant Cavern and the Captain Ilima, and Digimon living everywhere in the trial grass of the lowly city and the beat of the time. I sincerely look forward to judge. Oh, yeah! I reported to the folks upstairs that the Dio blocking the road outside, uh, uh, out front again. Crikey, that guy Tauros is pretty much a celebrity here in Mail Melee, you know. Well, I guess it's time to dismiss you from school, Abby. Attention all students. Abby has completed her lesson at the Duelist School. So, legitimately, you're just in the Duelist School until you fucking beat four trainers and that's it? Be good to your Digimon. Oh, hello, good time, Mas. Johnny. So much of beta. Okay, I'm, I'm good. You seem to be in perfect sync with your Memorag, won't you? Hmm. Since we've come this far together, why don't I just show you more of the city? Come on, there's lots to see. Here we go. This is I, dude! Abby, over here. Okay. I'm over here. You know, I was really impressed seeing how you dueled against... <laughs> dueled without... Uh, dueled with your Digimon at the Duelist School. It feels like you're really giving it, it your all for your Digimon's sake. I think that's why you were able to save Hoshigumo-chan that time, Abby. <gasps> oh, I forgot about the Tauros! I'll defeat this boy in his own home! He'll understand that his place in this world is under my heel! Or oh, if it isn't Lily and Abby. Sorry for scaring you, my friend. I guess it's time to get old Toros back home. I've got an idea, why don't you give him a little pat? You mean Dio? A mere monkey could never defeat a lion! Ha ha ha, you see that? This rascal already loves you. Yeah. Digimon become happier when you show them care. Wa ha ha! Oh, the places you'll go, child. And as you do, you'll surely meet more D Digimon and people who will enrich your life. Yeah, the Island King sure has something, eh? Able to claim rage and Digimon without even needing to duel. Now that's something, bruh. I mean, I like Tori's plenty and all, but it's pretty scary. I don't even want to ride on it. So, like, where are you off to now, bruh? I was thinking to show Abby around Ho 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 Holy City a bit. Yeah, nice idea. You're always on top of things, Lily. Abby, just got here to Alola, eh? Well, let me tag along, too. I want to go something good to eat, bruh. Alright, let's go together. Yeah, then what are we waiting for? Come on, let's go. Bruh. How? You're what? Oh, how? I guess we should go catch up to him before it gets too far, Abby. Of course, we can always stroll together. 
All right, here we go. Holy city. Oh man, I hope you have a good time. I, I, I feel like I tried to get make the text at least a little bit more interesting. I like how everyone's just doing the Alola thing. And there's this, this chick with her bikini. All right, Hal, what do you got to say? Don't say something stupid. Bikini time, yeah, bruh. Hal. Hey, hey, you. You've come up from Alola, from a long, far away place. I can tell. Now I'm going to teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola. You try it like that. And you say it. You'll make more friends, too. Okay, fine. Whatever you say, whatever floats your goddamn fucking boat, mate. Would you stop being sad? Yeah, Abby, I recognize the sound of those feet, bruh. So what do you think? Lola's gotta be the best place to live ever. Oh, yeah. Hey, Abby, you should come with me and, and get some shit. <clears throat> I mean... Yeah, hey, miss. Is it true you got some kind of special gift you got you have for a Luke Dex? My voice gives me the power of MPC insight. Now I'll teach you how to use it, even though you really don't want to. It's our very own Pokefinder. Here you go. <laughs> Yo, awesome, bruh. Isn't that awesome? You got a Pokefinder. So, like, what is it? Alright, well, I didn't edit this text, and this is just kind of obnoxious. Like I said at the beginning, like, we just got that loop Dex going on for us. And it's gonna it's gonna tell us uh, it's gonna tell us how to use it as soon as we get out of here. So that's cool beans. That's cool beans. I really don't don't care too much. Don't care too much. Abby, how did you see the tourist bureau? How was it? Yeah, we got her Luke Dex upgraded. We could take pictures. Oh, what a wonderful helper you are, Luke. <laughs> Yeah, what was that for, Luke? Go on, little trickster in your bag and follow me in the stomachs and... Good lord. Maybe Luke wanted your attention, because it always it wants to take pictures with you. I think you should stop by the art apparel shop to do some shopping of my own. Yeah, the apparel shop. That's what, that's what you need. Go, duelists! Look what you've got! Lucky kid, you got the Pokey Finder. You can now play Pokemon Snap, but not nearly as good. Okay, thanks. Look at me. I, I'm playing Pokemon Snap. Look at this. Look at this gorgeousness. Whoa! Chuk chuk, chuk chuk, chuk chuk, and chuk chuk, and chuk chuk, and chuk chuk, and man, I'm so good at this. I'm so good at this. Did you see this picture of this of the Pikachu's ears? I got 127 thumbs up for the side of a building. Let's go. Look at look at me go. All right, let's close. <laughs> let's get out of here. Okay. So now we can go to the Pokemon Center. Not really. We actually. Oh. Yeah, 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 you're not gonna let me do the ro the roto lotto already though. So, oh Abby, tell me, do you pick out your own clothes? Of course I do, idiot. Of course, M most people do, don't they? I I've always worn the clothes that my mother wanted me to wear. I I don't really know what kind of thing would suit me. Oh, uh, but that's not why I stop you. I meant to give you these, Abby. Um, I didn't even buy anything, but they said I was the 99,999th customer to visit their store. So, I've already bought the same set, so I thought that maybe you might want them. Yeah. Just what I needed. It looks like we have something in common now, don't we, Abby? 
yes. Probably. I should probably collect totem stickers, shouldn't I? I mean, that's a free totem encounter later on in the game. Greetings, Captain Lama here. You've spotted me checking out these lovely stickers. Oh yes, young trial goers in the Blob of Island Challenge in the... Okay. I can't let my dog down. Those Team Skull want to take track down duelists like you. Alright. Well, I mean, I might as well just collect the totem stickers, I guess. Alright, but randomized Pokemarts. So potentially, this could be, this could be like life-saving. Dwell into the future, but life-saving nonetheless. I mean, a completely random set of items await me. Yo, Garchomp Bite? I'll take that. Choice Scarf? I'll take that. Metagrossite? I'll take that. Cell battery can only be used once. Four grand. Nice. All right. Well, that's about all I can do for that. So that's that's. I mean, those, those aren't bad. Choice scarf could potentially be helpful at some point. I'm not really sure when, but we might as well get it anyway. All right. So first encounter for this route. What is it going to be? I'm hoping it's going to be something not terrible. Or, or it's just not going to show up at all, okay. Alright, here we go. First encounter for the Holy City is... A funky Kakuna! Why? Why? Oh my god. God, it's a goddamn fucking Kakuna. Alright. Out of all the Pokemon in the entire game, and it's a fucking Kakuna. You know what? I'm just gonna toss a Pokeball at this thing. It's level 10. It doesn't really have, like, any reason to not get in the Pokeball. I mean, a bug type might not be terrible. If we could get the Beedrillite, maybe? I mean, I, I could throw it on the team for now. I only shook once. Come on, my dude. We gotta, really gotta play these games. Oh my god, it broke out immediately. Alright. Let's let's switch into Kristoff. Look at Kristoff. He's freaking huge. Mud slap. Whoa bam. Alright, one more should not kill. But I'm gonna throw a Pokeball. See if we can't catch the, the boy Kakuna Matata. One, two, three. Okay. So we got our boy Big Dick B. So. I mean, that's good, right? Uh, really? No, no, no sprite. You don't got, you don't got sprite for the regular B drill. You have mega B drill. You have like every other type of B drill known to humankind. We're just gonna use the freaking generation like three sprite or something. Yeah, I'm not seeing a 
not seeing the sprite I'm looking for, so I might just grab the generation four, four sprite, five sprite, four sprite. This will just have to work. Well, we got our boy, uh, Big Dick B. Everybody know that Big Dick B. So Big Dick B's been added to the party. Oh, I mean, I, I, I have him on there as a B drill. It'll be a B drill in a minute. Don't, don't fret. Don't, don't, don't yell at me and say, you don't have a B drill yet. I'm aware, I'm aware, I'm aware, I'm aware, I'm aware. Pleasantly aware. Alright, this Ilima battle is kinda scary because I did lose to Ilima in my very first sleep lock I did of this game. So, definitely not some good memories with Ilima. So, I'm, at the very least, we're gonna kick Team Skull's ass. So, that's good. Yo, how's it, Abby? If you're looking for good eats, you found him, bruh. Plus, Malasadas make your Digimon like you. An affectionate Digimon are better in dueling. Who could resist their Digimon a few Malasadas? They're just so kawaii. Yo, 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 check it. Whenever, whenever we meet you, Team Skull doesn't even greet you. Yo, you gonna throw us a bone and hand over the island challenge amulets to us now? Oh, so you're part of that Team Skull, eh? All you guys do is steal totem stickers and people's Digimon and get in the way of other people's island challenges. Yo, 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 you know it, bro. The, uh, we hate the island challenge, yo. And every fucking words and shit, bro. <laughs> I tried to make it rhyme at the end. Yo, yo, check out... I changed the game with my mad Digimon skills. Alright, let's check out. Oh my goodness, the old lady's been corrupted. Madame Grunt. Oh man, I'm sorry old lady. I gotta kick your ass now. You and your Durant. Oh, did I? I led with Lilo. Yeah, you are annihilated. This thing ain't standing a single lick of a chance. Oh my god, it's faster than me. Holy shit, it just... Okay. Well, that was sketchy as fuck, but quad super effective. Durant goes down. Alright, Chime Echo. It's a psychic type? Do I just stay in? Yeah, I'm just gonna stay in. That sounds pretty... That sounds pretty fair to... It's SHINY! First encounter, Shiny Chimeco, zero soft resets. Unbelievable, we are out here tonight. Shiny Chimeco. Zero soft resets. Unbelievable. But the, the other trainer has, has it. Hey, what's up, Mr. Nintendo fan 6... How is it going? Hope you're having a good evening. I know I am. Oh, we got that burn too? That's nice. Can we get this bone club to hit? That would be nice. Alright, well, the old lady. Oh, yo, it's got. Oh, man. I'm just gonna heal. Well, actually, I don't need to heal because Ilima's gonna heal me. So that's fine. Great found great descriptions of movies. I, I, great. Uh, that's cool. That's cool. Congrats, my home dog. Lilo's up to level 14. Kristoff's level 14 as well. So we beat Madame Grunt. For real, it's over already. 
no fair. I was playing a different game. Yo, 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 let's get up to the poor bee. Nobody got to know about this. We don't even have those whack little emulets anyway. Wouldn't want to take them if you gave them to us. Bye. Yeah, this team st skull chicks really have too much time on their hands, eh? Their interrupting people's island challenges isn't going to make it like they managed to finish theirs, you know? I already went down to the marina and screamed out of the ocean, Watch out, world, someday I'm going to beat my old man Gramps in an all-out serious duel. So, like, maybe I'll go try to find more totem stickers next. See ya. All right, Elema's going to show up here. What a lovely tool you showed us there against Team Skull. Thanks, let my thanks to you and your Digimon. Why not I heal your team to express my gratitude? Alright, oh my god, this is scary. I must admit, I was, I've was i been worrying about you ever since I saw you- uh, wondering about you ever since I saw you at the Duelist School. Professor Kukui brought you along and you- and- and you and your Digimon seem to defeat our teacher so effortlessly. Very well then, allow me to see if you're ready for my trial. Okay. Behold the magnificent Digimon of the one and only Captain Illima. Alright. Oh my god, six Pokemon! Ah! Dancing family Illima, please don't send out Primal Coyote Thunder! It's shiny! <laughs> No, no. Oh my god. It's a shiny thunderous. <laughs> Look at this thing. It's purple. They use bite. Oh no, 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 no. How much is flame wheel doing? Absolutely friggin' nothing. Oh my god, but it's an electric type. Does it have any moves? Let me switch into Kristoff. Kristoff might be able to beat this thing. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, use bite. We eat that, right? Oh my god, that still did 8 damage. Uh, but it has levitate. I can't... Hey, you swagger! Would you stop it? I don't have it. <sighs> oh no. Snap out of it. No! Oh my god. No. None of these hit! Snap me out of confusion! Wait! Okay. Okay, hold up. Let me hit that potion. Let me hit that potion. Oh my god, if her other five Pokemon are like this, I am so screwed. Should I risk it? I don't feel like I sh Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do it. Use bite. Snap out of confusion. Snap out of confusion. Oh, well, not levitate. I, it, it levitates over the air because it's a flying type. It flinched me. Please don't hurt yourself, Kristoff. Thank you. Oh my god, it ate that up. Holy shit. It ate that up. That attack did absolutely nothing! Oh! Let's use Tackle. Use Bite. Oh, it's faster than me, and I flinch! Shit. Please stop flinching. Oh my god, please don't hurt yourself. Use Tackle. Okay. I'm gonna go for it again. It's been doing eight damage. We snap out of confusion this turn, right? I flinched. Fuck. Damn it, that really sucks. Alright, use bite. We snap out of confusion this turn and don't flinch. It's confusion flinching me. That's really, really smart. Okay, we snapped out of confusion. We're plus two tackle. It didn't die! Alright, it's gonna try and swagger me. Oh no, it potioned. It potioned. He potioned. That's fine. Plus two tackle. Bam. 
I swear to God, please kill. I used bite. It didn't. It didn't go for the uh, swagger. Okay, thunderous died. Oh my God. 469 experience that boosts us up to level 15. Fuck. All right, the rest of my team gained some experience. Gerald's up to level 16. Snevia's up to level 14. Big Dick B is up to level 11. About to send out Starly. I can I can fight Starly. I can fight Starly. Starly isn't terrifying. Thunderous, shiny thunderous, th shiny tea thunderous. That is scary. Level 11 Starly, not as scary. It doesn't seem like it had any electric type moves, but it could have just not been using them because they're not really that effective. Alright, Starly died, so there's two down. We got four left to go. Lilo grew to level 15. Big Dick B grew up to level 12. About to send out Gulpin. Alright, I'm going to stay in. It's a poison type. We should be able to knock this thing out relatively easily with Water Gun. I can hope. I can hope. Ugh, that doesn't even do half. Oh, it's yawning me. No, 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 no. Stop it. Do I go for it and use an Awakening? I'm going to go for it and use an Awakening. The strats. Use Yawn again. See, it predicted the double switch. Now, it's going to predict me... It's probably going to predict me to Awakening. But I'm going to do it anyway. Because it's still Yawn, so I still get the next turn. Okay. Okay. I didn't even do that. So, tackle kills, right? It sure does. It sure does. Sure does. Alright, Kangaskhan. Should I switch Digimon? Oh, yikes. My team's pretty battered right now. And Mega? It's not Mega. Okay. Parental Bond is kind of scary, I'm not going to lie. Alright, it's Tail Whipping me. That is fine. That is absolutely fine. How much is Water Gun doing? Is that doing over half? Not even remotely close. Wow, okay. Alright, it leered me. So my defense fell. And so it has two different moves to make my defense fall. What is it going to hit me with, though? Comet Punch. Okay, we, we just switch out. That, that'll work just fine. That did some pretty decent damage there. I'm going to switch out into Snevia. Alright, use Tail Whip. That is absolutely fine. We should be able to knock it out with a Vine Whip. Use Leer on me. My stats getting lowered like this is really not helpful. Alright. Withdrew Kangaskhan at 1 HP and sent out Combi. That double resists. So we're doing, yeah, absolutely nothing to that. Alright. We're going to play that Switch game. You want to play that Switch game? I'm going to play that Switch game. I, I, I tell you what, like, it is just so difficult to, it's so difficult because you have to, you have to really concentrate. Alright, this'll, this'll kill though, this is super effective, this combi gets blown back. So, what is there, three mons left, but one of them's already injured? Simi Seer. Shit. All right, let me let me heal Gerald. I don't. This thing might probably have fury swipes. How much is that gonna do to me? It's gonna do some pretty decent damage. Flame burst. All right, that didn't do very much. So I'm gonna hit that water gun. 
Oh, it's faster than me too. Gosh, Max Ivy's in speed and every other stat. All right, Kangaskhan is coming back out onto the field. So it's only at one HP, so she might heal up, but I'm gonna hit that tackle. All right, use fake out. That's that's obnoxious. How much is Comet Punch going to do to me, though? I'm actually worried. Oh no, it's, it's tail whipping me. I think we'll be. I think we'll be good. We'll be good. It's going to lower my defense to try and kill me. Yeah. But then I just switch out for what I believe is the last Mon. I assume. Oh no, we won. We won. Jero grew to level 17. We lost no Mon. Snevy is up to level 15. Kristoff's up to level 16. Big Dick B's up to level 13. And we defeated Dan Dancing Family Ilima. See, there's there's Big Dick B. I knew it was going to evolve by the end of the episode, so... Um, Big Dick B on the layout already. That battle was scary, dude. He led with a freaking thunderous T, and I was like, it's over. But there's your boy... Big Dick B. Learns Twin Needle. Alright, so in the next episode we get our, our next encounter, so that's super good. You, or should I say you and your Digimon, make quite an interesting team. I do hope you'll come to Verdun Tower and attempt by trial the trial of Elima. You, uh, you can get there from Route 2. That Luke Dex of yours should show you the way. I bid you Alola. I bid you in United States of America, bitch. Frida! Oh, no, yeah, that doesn't really work, does it? Well, there's really not much that I can do. Your nice, smooth, shiny body. All right, there, Luke. Luke Dex. LCD screen. Alrighty then. Alrighty then, mate. Well, that is an, all the time we have for this episode. So thank you guys so much for uh, sticking around. Make sure you guys click that thumbs up button down below for me. Because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. As well as uh, hitting the subscribe button. Leaving a comment in the comment section down below for me. Because you already know your support, again, is greatly appreciated. Like I just said five seconds ago. But we'll see you all in the next episode.